Red, it's time for Green Wave Tournament Hockey. We are quickly going to look back at tonight's goal scorers. Just about five minutes into this game, Dylan Archer, blue line shot, picked up his first varsity goal. Congratulations to Dylan. A slapper from just above the top of the circle. After a good sustained effort by Green Wave, Wispin taking that first shot, jerk a rebound shot, kicks out. Good hard slapper. Late in the first period, Shane Prusak was over in his office, collected the power play marker on the one-timer, made it 2-0 Green Wave. Hard shot. Rebound comes squirting out to Prusak. Prusak from the love side circle there just fires it right up into the toy department. That was no doubter. Fantastic power play goal. Just 25 seconds into the second period of play, Kevin Bauman was along the boards down to our right. Sent a laser when top shelf made it 3 0 Green Wave. That shot just off his shoulder, I couldn't tell, but it was right in there, top. And now it's a 3 0 lead on the first shot of the second period. Early in the third period, Sammy Knight, who went top shelf on Saturday night against Mount Everett, was spun around in the slot. Jake Proto had just uh, found him after having taken an unsportsmanlike penalty. Proto found him, put the puck right out there, and uh, Sammy Knight got the stick on it, made it 4 0 Green Wave. Proto working hard, gains the zone, coming down the blocker side of Midas. Kind of dishes it into Sammy's feet. Sammy finds it right in the low slot. Is able to get a little backhand on it and put it low blocker side on Midas for a fourth goal. Four nothing green wave. But then Belchertown had their sense of urgency. Francis Henderson, their leading goal scorer, got them on the board, made it 4-1. Less than a minute later, four to two. Then it was Kitty bar the door. Belchertown took their time out. They came back and with 39.7 seconds remaining in regulation time, Andrew Fiegel, after, I don't know, a six or seven shot flurry on Josh Bordeaux, finally got it under and made it 4-3. And we're all biting our nails up here, but a nice defensive play at the blue line by Matt Lavoine. Got the pass out to Trevor Kaczewski, who fired the retro rockets. Went down, hit the empty net, five to three. Big block shot by Lavoine over there in the right side center circle. Somehow finds a way to a streaking Kaczewski. He puts on the afterburners. Nobody on Belchertown could catch him. And that, with 8.2 seconds, should probably ice it. Wow, exciting, exciting playoff hockey. It looked like Belchertown was down for the count early in the third, but they came roaring back, made it a game, but Green Wave held on. From the Olympian West Springfield, final score, Green Wave five, Belchertown Orioles three. I am the skate doctor, Lou Bordeaux. And this is Skate Doc saying good night from the Olympia.